How to win a street fight. You should never try to use physical means to settle a problem with someone on the street. The first thing that you should do is try to resolve any issues or diffuse any problems with words. However, if you do find yourself in a situation where you must defend yourself, it's important that you understand basic street fighting tactics to stay safe and come out on top. If you try to avoid fights, learn how to defend yourself, and use the proper martial arts techniques and tactics to defeat your opponent, you can feel safe and confident if you end up in a confrontation with someone violent. Defending yourself. Stay safe at all times. Though you may not get to choose where a fight breaks out, there are things that you can do to increase your safety in a self-defense scenario. Avoid fighting in the middle of the street or on hard sidewalks, concrete, or places with sharp or hard edges like concrete steps. If your aggressor pulls out a weapon like a knife or a pipe, you should just try to run away from them. 1. If someone is trying to rob you at gunpoint, you should give them whatever they want instead of risking serious injury or death. Sometimes self-defense and self-preservation means submitting to force to stay alive. Damage the soft spots on your opponent. Attacking areas like the face, temples, throat, kidneys, solar plexus, may eventually incapacitate your opponent. Hitting the nose blurs the eyes and causes pain, and it just might leave your opponent dazed long enough to get away. Attack their legs. Low kicks should be aimed towards shins, ankles, the insides or back of calves or thighs and kneecaps if their legs are straight. Do not aim higher than knee or waist height because they will grab your leg. If you have an object like a bat or pipe, you can also aim for their legs. If your opponent is unable to walk or pursue you, you can get away safely without continuing the fight. Attack your opponent from behind. Attacks from behind are difficult to see and avoid, and in a real fight, it is not cowardly to strike from behind. Watch your back, and attack that of your opponents. Use lateral movement to move side to side and circle your opponent. Attacking your opponent's legs or getting control of his arms from behind may allow you to hold them down long enough for help to arrive. Headbutt your opponent fast and hard. Bring the top your forehead down to their nose and face. A headbutt can easily knock someone out or break bones in a person's face. Make sure to tuck in your chin and strike with the top of your head. Aim for the area containing their eyes, nose, and mouth. Learn to grapple. A successful grapple can put you in control, even if the attacker is much stronger or faster than you. Popular grappling styles include Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, Sambo, and wrestling. Learn how to submit, slam, or choke your opponent if you want to end the fight early. Getting positional control when the fight goes to the ground is also incredibly important. 